you guys, I'm Nick, aka the Warrior Nicks Games. Today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to install multiple Minecraft mods on the same exact version of Minecraft 1.8 to be exact. Now, this is without Forge. If you want to do Forge, sadly it's not out at the time this video is being made in 1.8, but if Forge is out, there will be a link in the description as soon as it comes out to where you can go and see how to do it with Forge. However, this is not with Forge. So let's go ahead and jump on into this. Today we are going to be installing too many items and fast building in Minecraft 1.8. Fast building allows you to, well, build fast, and too many items allows you to access a ton of creative-like features in survival. So first off, let's go ahead and download too many items. You want to go to the first thing in the description or Minecraft 4.0, that's just forms, it doesn't matter. It's the first link, go, go click it. And uh, it'll take you to this page where you can scroll down to where you see downloads and then under downloads you'll see for 1.8 non forge version right click on that open it in a new tab and boom here it is we have to wait on AdFly. While we're waiting on AdFly, I'm going to say this. If you have any issues, please reload AdFly. Right-click on the page and reload. If that doesn't work, Google how to enable cookies on Google Chrome, Mozilla Firefox, whatever your browser is, and then see if that works for you. Come back and see if it works. If it doesn't, well, sadly, there's not really much we can do. AdFly is something we have to put up with because these mod creators need a little bit of money for all the work they put into their mods, and uh, AdFly is how they do that. Nevertheless, after you've waited five seconds, right up here in the top right-hand corner, you can click Skip Ad and uh, it downloads. Once you've done that, we can go ahead and go to the second link in the description or mycraftform.net. It doesn't matter. Second link. Still, click it. It's, it's much easier than typing all that. Anyway, you'll take you to this page here on the Minecraft Forum, Fast Building 1.2. Scroll down until you see latest version download right here. It's under B. Latest version download. Click that. And it will then take us again off to AdFly, where we again, right up here in the top right hand corner, have to wait five seconds. One, zero, skip the ad, and it'll take us to Mediafire, where we then can finally click download. It'll then download the mod, and we can minimize. And here it is on our desktop. I accidentally downloaded too many items twice, but too many items and fast building. If they're not here on your desktop, hit the Windows key on your keyboard and R at the exact same time and type in downloads. Hit enter. They'll be right here. So they'll be in this folder. If they are here, drag them over to your desktop. I also want to say that you do need WinRAR for this. If you haven't downloaded WinRAR, it's the third link in the description. rgd.us slash WinRAR. That will take you up to a page where you can see exactly what's going on with WinRAR. Download it. Get it set up. Very, very easy. Just like downloading any other program you have in your computer like Skype or Photoshop or a Google Chrome a browser whatever anything like that is just like downloading it so go do that get that installed once you're done with that come back to this video nevertheless once you're back on the video simply hit the Windows key on your keyboard and R at the same time again so Windows key on your keyboard and R at this exact same time and then type in percent APB DATA percent and hit enter it will then take us off to the roaming folder where we then need to go into dot minecraft and then go into versions at the very very bottom in here you will most likely just have 1.8 or 1.8 and a bunch of like 1.7.10 and 1.7.2 and all that stuff but we want to focus on this right here 1.8 we want to right click on it copy it and then right click in this white space and paste it that'll give us something called 1.8 dash copy but that's not what we want. We want to rename this by right clicking on it and renaming it 1.8 TMI FB. So TMI space FB. Too many items, space, fast building. Now we want to copy or copy all of this. So we want to write or just click over here, just normal click and drag your mouse over. Then we want to right click on this, copy it, right? Copy this text. And then boom, there's that. Now we want to go into this folder and rename both this executable jar file and this JSON file to what we just named the folder right back here. So right click on the executable jar file, open it or rename this file. So right click on it and rename it and then right click again and click paste. We then want to do that for the JSON file as well. Right click on it, rename, right click again, click paste. Bada bing, bada boom, there you go. Now we want to open the JSON file in Notepad. Do this, right click on it, open with, and it'll bring up this nice little dialog box, and double click on Notepad. Once you've got this open, you'll see all of this text. Don't freak out about it. Just simply go to where it says 1.8 in the first line up here, highlight where it says 1.8, and then right click and paste 1.8 space dash space TMI space FB. Once you've done that, you can go ahead and click File, Save, close out of this, and now we need to start using WinRAR. 
what we need to do is we need to open up this executable jar file with WinRAR. To do this, right click on it, open it with WinRAR Archiver. It'll open it right like that, bada bing, bada boom, there we go. Move it over to the farthest right of your, or your window screen. And then we want to open up both of these mods. Right click on them both, or right click on one of them, open with WinRAR Archiver, in this case too many items. And then right click again on Fast Building and open that with WinRAR Archiver. Okay, so we can format the screen a little better here by moving this over and kind of giving us a little bit more looking room where we can see things a bit better. But now all we've got to do is first delete the meta inf and the 1.8 space dash space TMI space FB. So the, basically the version we created of Minecraft here, we want to right click on meta inf and delete the files. Click yes, that'll go away. Boom, meta inf is gone. Now installing these mods is very, very easy. Go to the TMI one right here, the TMI folder, too many items. And just highlight everything in this folder except this first thing right up here. So highlight all the content in this folder. Oh, come on now. There we go. Scroll all the way down to the bottom. Click it and drag it over into 1.8 space dash space TMI. Drag it over there. Click OK. Boom. It is now in there. You want to do the same thing for the fast building mod right over here. As you can see, fast building. Highlight the three things that are in that folder, that file. Click them and drag them over into 1.8 space dash space TMI space FB. Drop them in there. Click OK. It'll go through. Copy them over. And guess what? We can now close out of all of this stuff. We can delete these files we downloaded. And we can open up the Minecraft launcher. I'll meet you guys there. Once you're in the Minecraft launcher, we need to choose the version we just created. To do that, simply go to the uh, the profile you want to play. In my case, that's Dead Buddha. Hit Edit Profile, and then you'll see Use Version right here. Yours most likely says Use Latest Version or Release 1.8. Click that, right? Click Use Version right here where it says Release 1.8 or Use Latest Version. Click this little arrow right here. It will then drop it down, and you'll see Release Space 1.8 Space Dash Space TMI Space FP. That should be very familiar to you at this point. Click that, click Save Profile, click Play. It will now open up Minecraft with both of those mods installed. I will meet you guys on the main menu. Once you're on the Minecraft main menu, testing to see if these mods are working is very, very easy. Launch into any world you want. I'm just going to launch into this test world I have, everything 1.8. And uh, we're going to test to see if these mods are working. So once it opens up, we can hit E and boom, here is too many items. Let's go ahead and get some polished diorite, right? We can drag that over, or wait, we've got to change the change the game mode. It's been a while since I've used this. Let's see. Um, there we go. So there it is, spruce wood. We just click it. Boom, we can get all the things. We'll go ahead and place down some gold ore here by hitting control and clicking and placing a block as you normally would. Boom, it builds all the way up to the top. That's fast building and working. That's... Too many items in working, as I said, or working. And, um, yeah, there you guys have it. I hope that helps you guys out. That's how you can install two mods in Minecraft 1.8 without Forge. Um, yeah, pretty, pretty simple. If you guys have any questions, post them in the comment section down below. I or somebody else who this worked for will try our best to help you out. Anyway, guys, I'm Nick's Games again, and I am out. Peace. Subscribe if you haven't already. I make awesome Minecraft content every single day of the week. And here's some videos you guys might want to go check out. On the left is Modtastic Episode 8. That is my weekly modded Minecraft series where there are over a hundred and eight mods or 108 mods there are 108 mods in that series it is awesome go check it out i think you'll enjoy it if you enjoy minecraft mods and on the right is choose a youtube network how do you choose the perfect youtube network for you well that video tells you exactly how to do so so go check it out also check out my daily vlogs the bomb series you can see what i'm doing every single day of my life anyway guys i'm nick's games and i am out peace